If you are experiencing acid reflux, bloating or have an inflamed gut, then this red cabbage juice recipe is a must try for you. Red cabbage is a great source of vitamin C, vitamin K, B6, magnesium and potassium. So to start this recipe, I'll be first chopping the red cabbage in half. You need to take a sharp knife to chop the red cabbage because the core is a bit hard and also it needs to be discarded. After that, you need to chop the cabbage vertically so that you get thin shreds. I'm chopping all the cabbage but you can keep half a side for coleslaw or any other recipe. So when compared to green cabbage, red cabbage has a lot more flavonoids and antioxidants that's why it's superior in nutrients. When the cabbage is perfectly chopped, then you need to take a glass bowl or any other bowl and transfer everything in it. Next, I'm taking an apple. This is to enhance and make the flavor of the juice much more sweeter because cabbage has a lot of earthy and uh, different taste which is not meant for everyone's palate. So you can also increase the quantity of apple. You can make it two if you want to or add any other fruit like pineapple. Once the apple is chopped, now it's time to transfer it in the same bowl. Next, I'm taking half a cucumber but you can take any other vegetable which has a lot of water content in it because that will make this uh, juice a bit more watery and a bit more liquidy. So once you have sliced and chopped the cucumber in small bits, transfer it in the same mixing bowl. Once all your veggies are chopped properly, then you need to add it in a blending or a mixing jar. So blend it on a higher setting till you get a smooth consistency like this. Now to be sure that the juice doesn't contain any lumps or unblended veggies, that's why I'm sieving it. So some people don't mind getting vegetable bits in their juice and if you're one of them, then you can totally skip Use this Use a later or any spatula to make the process a bit fast and you can like apply a bit of pressure so that the pulp gets out much more easily. So now the cabbage juice is ready to be served. Another thing that you might not know is that red raw cabbage contains 85% of the daily recommended intake of vitamin C which is really good and amazing for your health. I'm adding mint leaves on top and I'll stir it later on but this step is completely optional. It just adds a hint of freshness and that is something I need in my juice. So the next time you experience bloating or unhealthy cut, then you need to follow this recipe and stay tuned for more such videos.